Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So guys, today in this video, I'm gonna tell you how to fix voicemail not working on iPhone after iOS 17 update. So guys, many iPhone iPhone users are complaining about that after updating to iOS 17, they are facing an issue of voicemail not working. They don't know how to fix this. So guys, in this video, I'm gonna tell you how to fix this voicemail not working issue on iPhone after iOS 17 update. First of all, you have to check your voicemail settings. Go to the iPhone app and then tap voicemail. Check if there are any promotes or error. Make sure your voicemail is set up correctly. Then you have to restart your iPhone. A simple restart can often fix various issues. Turn off your iPhone by going to settings. Go back and then go to general. Scroll down and then tap on shutdown. Shut down your iPhone and then restart it after 15 to 20 seconds later. After restarting your iPhone, then you have to check your iOS update. Go to go to software update and see if it's then there any available update for your iPhone. If there is, then simply update your iPhone to the latest version of iOS 17. After updating the latest to the latest version of iOS iOS 17, then you have to check your cellular connection. Ensure that you have a stable cellular connection. If you are, if you are in a in area with a poor reception, it might affect voicemail functionality. You have to make sure that you are in a strong you have a strong and stable cellular connection. After checking your cellular connection and you're still facing the same issue, then you have to do is visual voicemail. If you are using visual voicemail, ensure that it's set up correctly. Go to your settings, then go to phone tap on phone then go to voicemail and see if it's enable or disable if it's disable then simply enable it then you have to check your storage space sometimes if your device is low on storage it can affect voicemail functionality check your available storage in settings by going to general Then go to iPhone storage and see if uh, and check those apps which are consuming a lot of storage. If there is any app which you do not want to use or which is unused, then try simply uninstalling them or offloading them. For applying this all instead of facing the same issue, then you can try is reset network settings. This will reset Wi-Fi, password, VPN, and APN settings. So you have to go to your general, then scroll down and then tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Tap on reset. Tap on reset nitro settings, enter your passcode and fix your issue. So guys, if this video helps you then make sure to like and subscribe my YouTube channel for upcoming videos and thanks for watching.